Hey, what's up, guys? Tally Hall Dodge C Mission 2 has started. Over 135k NFTs claimed during Bridge Week. Remember, I did a video about the Bridge Week, and this is a video in my YouTube channel where we had to bridge to Arbitrum for Optimism, Polygon, or Ethereum using the various bridges available. I hope a lot of you participated in this week one. But just in case you didn't participate in week one, I think you can still go ahead to participate in the mission. Two. The food dodgy takes off next day, but we have one more treat. Bull week is here. Now that you have bridged to Arbitrum, we did that in Bridge Week 1, level up by providing liquidity with some of our favorite protocols. Okay, what we're going to do is actually very simple. We just follow the directive or direction given by Tally Hall. This mission 2 started in December 12th and it will be ending on December 21st. All right, this simply means we have to use our Tally Hall wallet. So right in your Tally Hall wallet, you switch over to the Arbitrum network. I'll show you how to do that. Then you have to provide $50 or more of USDC or DAI in liquidity to at yield protocol to claim the multi Bulldog NFT. Then secondly, you have to provide $10 of wrap ETH into the ETH weekly SSOV on Adobes underscore IO to claim his part, which is Tom. And once you claim, you'll be automatically entered into a giveaway for a Diamond Peps 199 NFT, which is what you can see right here. You can either have $10 or $50 to perform one of these tasks. But if you have $60, you can go ahead to perform both tasks, which in my opinion is very good for you. But note that this is not a financial advice. Do your own research and decide what you want to do with your funds. If you perform one task, you get one NFT. If you perform both tasks, you get two NFTs. So these are what the NFTs looks like. Yeah, for providing liquidity in Youth Protocol, you will get this very NFT. And for Dopers, you will also get the same NFT just by providing liquidity also in dope s this is exactly where you will come to claim your nft as soon as you have done the needful i'll leave all the links in the description now let's go ahead and perform the tax first we go to yield protocol and of course you want to connect your tally hall wallet so click on connect wallets here it is click on it now connect wallets yeah we are connected and we're on the arbitrum network you can switch that in your tally hall just go there look at it i'm on arbitrum if you're not on arbitrum you can just click here and switch over to the Arbitrum network. It is that simple. And it says provide liquidity. We have to select the token and we are providing liquidity in USDC. So click here and you select USDC. Otherwise, you select DAI if you're providing in DAI. For me, I'm going with USDC. So I click this and I have a little above $50 in my account. Remember, we're supposed to provide $50 in yield protocol. So enter 50. That is it. Now click on next step review your transaction if you're happy with what you're seeing go ahead and agree with them and then click on pool 50 usd your tally hall will pop up for you to confirm the transaction do just that then sign the contract interaction add liquidity is processing and that is successfully added you can see that transaction completed take a look over here you will see my position right here tokens worth about 49 dollars but it's supposed to be 50 i guess the took transaction fee so what i would do is to try to add it up to 50 later on okay and if you want to see a clearer picture of your position you head straight to dashboard scroll down you will see your liquidity here is mine and then if you want to remove this liquidity anytime you're ready to do so just click on this and you will see the option to remove your liquidity right here you can go ahead to remove max or you can remove less than 100%. It all depends on you. So with this, we have provided liquidity in yield protocol. And next, we head straight to dopress.io. Here it is. Click on launch app, then connect your Tally Hall wallet. Click on this. Click connect. We are connected. Now, remember, we are asked to do this in XSOV. So click on this. Select the eat week, which is right here. Click on manage. According to the instruction, we are asked to provide $10 worth of wrap ETH into the ETH weekly SSOV on Dope X. And that is what we are going to do. This is the amount of wrap ETH I have. I think it's exactly $10. So I'll just click on max and approve it. Sign. Sign in your tally hall. Then click on deposit and sign in your tally hall. We have successfully deposited into the ETH weekly SSOV. How do we know that? We scroll down to check out our position and here it is this is the amount i just deposited and you can withdraw your funds by the time the withdrawal 
button is unlocked so you need to note that the withdrawals are locked until the 16th of december okay so you cannot withdraw your funds immediately so guys this is exactly how to provide liquidity in the eat weekly ssov in dopest.io platform remember to go and check galaxy to see if you have become eligible to claim your nft yeah thank you so much for watching i trust you like this video please smash the like button share this video everywhere so that others can take advantage of this beautiful opportunity also remember that tallyho already has a token confirmed and they'll be doing an airdrop anytime soon so share this video so that others can take advantage of the opportunity i'm definitely going to see you in my next one and don't forget we're going to make it bye